Welcome back. The pandemic, of course, has caused the 2020 Tokyo Olympics to be canceled this year. And Special Olympics here in Mississippi has had to cancel its in-person events as well. 12 News' Kate Cornell explains how it has not slowed them down, though, one bit. Freedom Ridge Park in Ridgeland hasn't been used by Special Olympics in months. However, they have not let it stop their operations altogether. Special Olympics took to online workouts and meetings so that the athletes can stay in shape and stay informed. President and CEO Monica Daniels says they are making lemonade out of lemons. We like to say inclusion is a contact sport, and, but right now inclusion can be over your phone or your laptop. and. In the state of Mississippi alone, there are over 75,000 individuals with uh, different developmental and intellectual disabilities. So we want to reach everyone. Everyone is welcome to the table. Coming up on 12 News, we will hear from an athlete as well as her coach who says that she has been an exemplary role model during such a difficult time. In Ridgeland, Kay Cornell, 12 News.